Oh, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of an Aussie Fummy in Philippines. Well, it's the last day for me to go and check the durians. They're supposed to be getting harvested today, inshallah. So it'd be good if they do, because I've already paid for them. And uh, the guy who came and bought them before, he brought he just bought one whole tree at a time once. And uh, he came, he turned up, he turned up yesterday and said to check, how's your durians going, blah, blah, blah. There's a couple here I got from goat herding yesterday. He said, how's your um, durians going? And she said, um, they were going to be harvested on Tuesday. And he went, what, I've missed out. Oh God, it's what about your rambutans? Yeah, he's buying them too. Oh no. So what about your logosteins? No, they're not ready yet. Still got time. Oh God, I've missed out, he said. All right, I'll come back. I'll keep in touch with you. So good on him. So I come up here and had a look earlier. I always have a look first because sometimes it's not fallen overnight. Then if they are, I'll go back for the barra. But um, have a look here, look. Hairy balls are out, guys. Hairy balls are out. Look at this, full of ants because there's sugar. So how do, you, how do you open these little bastards? Look at these hairy balls. They're bloody perfect, don't they? All right. So squeeze it from end to end. Squeeze. Put in your hand and squeeze it. There you go, chirpens up. Inside it's just like a grape. Just like a grape it is, and it's as sweet as sweet it can be. Talk about the ants, the little bit of meat in your fiber doesn't doesn't hurt. Okay, that's it. That's your baby. That is your baby. Mm. 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 Bloody dick loads. Should cut those branches down outside, you know. Well, so apparently they're going to harvest these, but when, I don't know. When, I don't know. The goats love them. The goats to go ape shit over them. Well, look at this, look. Look at that. That's it. So he's there. Heaps of ants, but they don't bite, so it's no problem. They don't bite these buggers. Drop them down, flick them off, look. Not an issue. Wow. Not an issue. God, look at them all. Look at them all. Mm. I'll have to get and pick these up before the goats get up here. Normally the bats are the ones that attack them. You find them all eaten out. Mm. Right. Look at them they're everywhere. My God. I'll get a bag here just on the ground. Mm. These ones aren't ready yet. God bless every balls. Probably just going off at something in the corner. And that's all you're left with is seed, guys. That's it, don't eat the seed of course. Do not eat the seed. It's like a, a um, uh, what do you call it, dates. Sickle seems like dates, eat the outside and split the seed out. It's probably going off at. Polly! Polly! What is it, baby? What is it? So these people cleaned up the other day. Left the water bottle, looks like I left a shirt on the line. Big mango tree. Mango tree, you gotta spray them with some chemical to make them flower. Weird shit. Spray this fucking fruit all the time. Pain in the arse, they are. There's nothing near, Paul. Baby, there's nothing near. Come on. Oh, look at all these ones. Here, look. This is next to the avocado trees here. Look at these. Look, look, look. That's all dollars, guys. This is avocado trees. So whoever buys this back lot will be very impressed. You know, the harvest is just what... People say, oh, you're asking too much for it. No, if it was just flat land or hilly land that had nothing on it, it's X amount. But this is fully stocked. It's fully fenced. It's fully stocked. It's got all the durians. It's got all the avocados. The hairy balls, longestines, mangoes, 
<coughs> all the coconut harvest as well. It's all fully stocked. All fully stocked, ready to go. You buy the land and everything that's on it. Everything. I tell you, this is a beautiful block, this one. If anyone's interested, talk to Chick on Facebook. Whenever you want. Facebook. Yeah. So let's go and have a look over this way. Uh, I'll be putting the house over here. This area here, there's, there's minimal trees here. That's why I'll be putting the house. That way you still got your avocados, you still got all your durians, you still got your rambutans. You got everything still. Alright. What a lovely morning it is today, guys. Look at these, look, this is dollars, guys. This is what you call successful farming. This is what you call it. Look at it, oh. Amazing. There's one clump, they're, they're growing like, um, they're actually growing like they're grapes, or a bunch of grapes together. It's like, fuck me, I've seen this day, I went, Christ. Let's go over this way. This is the first one that flowered. And it's been dropping. This one here, look. I can't see them in on the GoPro, but look at these. Look, look at them up here. They're like bunches of fucking grapes. So much money in there, guys. So much money. Don't worry about laying down plastic and fucking weed control and all that shit that they do on Bahal with the fat farting farmer over there. This is what it's about. This is real farming. No fails here. No fails. Right, I'm going to get these durian and pick up all these ramutans. Alright, look at them all. So many of the darlings. Little bundles of money. So I've got these ones. These are the ones that have just fallen on the ground here. The other trees are still green. They were late to bud. But um, look at them all. Look. Look at all the little bundles of happiness money. Look at it all. Oh. So I've just picked up the ones that are on the ground here at the moment, so it's a good harvest, a very good harvest guys. So think your land out, if you're going to have a farm, think your land out, where you're going to put your trees and get them in. Oh, look at these, there's so many of them, so many. Alright guys, I'm going to go back, feed all the chickens, feed the pigs, turkeys, ducks, and I'm going to feed myself for brekkie. So wherever you are today, have a great day, I'm going to go and work on Big Red. I got the new um, steering wheel shaft and the mechanism, whatever you want to call it, has arrived yesterday. So I'm going to get Big Red going today so that tomorrow morning, Sparrow Fart, I can get up and start do, start mowing. Polly, come on, baby. Jeez, I wish I could bring stubs up here like that. Fucking stubs would be jumping for the wire and go, mate. Hey, guys. Well, I've just come back from harvesting the durians and the hairy balls, and I've just seen Wilfredo come back with his. Oh, the noise, aren't they? Oh, wowza! Hi, Mary Lou. Hi. Hi, hi. Hello. Jerry. Good morning. Have a look at this. It's not a bad morning's harvest, is it? Happy? Happy. God. Mary Lou just got out of hospital yesterday. She lost half her body weight. and um, But she's still going, kicking around all right. How's... Right, so they said they get, uh, they're getting roughly 25? Yeah. But 25 pesos a kilo is what they're getting, farm gate prices. So um, it's good money, guys. He's got a bloody good orchard going over here, mate. I tell you, he's got corn popping up now as well. Everything is go, go, go. Uh. Right, so, so Wilfredo and Jerry have got their shit together on their vegetables, I tell you. You know, and the thing is, he does all his weeding by hand. He does. Oh, look at these little buggers. All right, so they've kept free. So they kept free of the little buggers. Right. Well, Mum's got conditions, right? Her titties are going back to normal. Hey, gorgeous. Hello. So they're still going with those. It's still no good as their harvest, guys. Hey. Look at that. Look at that. Hey. So you want? That's bloody good, mate. So Jerry's straightening them all up now. It's like those those banana benders when they grow bananas. You got to bend them. You know to put the bend in the banana. So he's got to make them straight. He breaks them all straight. <laughs> So they're sorting them all out now from um, first class, second class, and so forth. But, uh, that's not a bad morning, guys. Not a bad morning at all.
All right, guys, that's us for today. We'll catch you later on. So thanks for watching us on Yozzy Farm. See you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.